one more thing if you have noticed here is that we are not handling the uh, validation errors so if i like show you in the postman just go to the sign up and try to remove this password and hit send so even if there is a validation error it's still saying something went wrong because when we are like saying uh, sign up schema dot parse we are not handling that anywhere whether this succeeded or failed so what we can do is in the error handlers so we are checking for the http exceptions here so if the error is of type http exceptions we don't need to do anything but if it's not of type http exception there is a chance that it's a validation error so we have to place another check here so we can say that if error instance of zod error so zod error is a type which is exported by this library zod which we are using to perform all the validations so here we can say that exception is equal to new uh, bad request exception and we can say that unprocessable entity and in the error code we can say that uh, error code dot unprocessable entities and we can pass the error and inside the else clause now we can now move this statement up now it should work now if you go to the postman and give a try you can see that it's now giving an unprocessable entity exception so name is the zod error and you can see that the password is required so that was a bit of a change which we need to do in order to handle this uh, exceptions regarding the validations